Okay, so this knot is the non-slip mono loop, and I'm using uh, 25 pound mono. Basically what you do is you tie an overhand knot, like that, and then take the, the tag end and put it through, doesn't matter, either side of the, of the hook, but I'm going to put it through the eye of the hook from the top, and I'm going to pull that a little bit closed, the knot, the original knot, give myself a little more to work with. So I've got about three inches from the knot down. And I'm going to take that tag end and put it up through the knot and then slide that knot down closer to the eye of the hook like that. And then I'm going to pinch it right there and go over the top of the standing line once, twice, and after the third turn, since I came up through that through that original knot, I'm going to go down through that knot. I came up through it, I'm going to go down through it. Grab it with my teeth and pull it tight. And I usually use my, my pliers, but anything that you can pull it tight with, like that, and then that gives you the loop. If you did it right, this the tag end will come off at a right angle like that. Okay, this time I'm using 50 pound test. Overhand knot, leave the wraps on top, like that. Through the eye of the hook, doesn't matter which direction. Up through the knot, cinch it down a little bit. I'm just gonna go around twice now and then down through the knot. It came up through the knot, so you go back down through it. So the heavier the line, the fewer wraps you need to do. And then there's that right angle off of the knot.